Conference Room, an exclusive update on all things MEAC. On Friday, November 13, 2015, selected Student Athlete Advisory Committee leaders and advisors met at the Marriott Chesapeake Hotel in Chesapeake, Virginia for the Fall 2015 MEAC SAC Leadership Meetings. The annual MEAC SAC Meetings consist of a weekend-long workshop held for the representatives of 13 MEAC member institutions to voice their concerns, gain feedback from other students, engage with the speakers, and take part in activities designed to enhance their leadership skills. Here's theme was Leadership Sharing the Vision and Shaping the Future, led by the MEAC's Assistant Director of Compliance and Championships, Contrell Kearney, and the Championships and Compliance Intern, Matt Thompson. The purpose of this event was to educate our students on leadership and professional development, but also allow them the opportunity to come up here and express exactly what they have accomplished so far this season. Um, I feel like it was a great opportunity for each of our student athletes to interact with each other and to take a step aside from being competitors but to now work as teammates throughout the entire conference and, and come up with ideas to help the conference as a whole. The event kicked off with a discussion from Mr. Reginald Bean, Director of Multicultural Marketing for Coca-Cola Bottling Company, who spoke to Zach members and their advisors on what they will need in life to unlock opportunities in the future. Is it easy? Absolutely not. I'm not here to tell you how, how easy life is. We started off the conversation by saying life was difficult. And so it's just a matter of how much are you going to dig in? How much do you grind it out? Because it is just that. If it was easy, everyone would be doing it. That's exactly right. Following day consisted of team building exercises, SAC leaders providing brief updates on their institutions, keynote speakers, and an interactive Q&A panel discussion with three MEAC athletic professionals. Athletic Director at University of Maryland Eastern Shore, Mr. Keith Davidson, Senior Woman Administrator at Delaware State University, Ms. Mary Hill, and Dr. Kare Banks, Faculty Athletic Representative at Norfolk State University, discuss their roles in the athletic departments, their thoughts on decision making, and leadership advice for the SAC leaders. Those of you that are interested in going on to graduate school or any, um, maybe accepting or applying for any funding post um, your institution, you guys are involved in SAC. Please take full advantage of that. Utilize the community service venues to help get some things done. Later that day, the SAC leaders participated in a community service for the 4Kids organization where they decorated Thanksgiving baskets that will be donated to families in the Norfolk, Virginia area. The fun didn't stop there as they ended off day two with music, food, and traditional games at the hotel. On Sunday, November 15th, the conference concluded with the guest speaker, ATM Thomas, Senior Woman Administrator from North Carolina Central University, speaking on information relative to the NCAA Division I Council and Student Athlete Experience Committee, and a Q&A session with the MEAC Senior Associate Commissioner, Sonia Stills. What I think the student athletes got out of the question and answer segment was how the conference worked, what how things are decided as far as when a recommendation comes from an individual group, whether it's coaches, whether it's uh, administrators or student athletes, how that process goes within the structure of the conference. Um, they were able to ask any questions regarding any rumors they may have heard so they can get the accurate information. So I hope that they were able to gain a better knowledge of how to research what they are interested in, what they want to know, and to understand that their voice, the student athlete voice, is strong. After spending a weekend together, the student athletes became very close and plan on staying in touch with each other. Mid-Eastern Athletic Conference, educating student athletes for the game of life.